All right, I want you to, I want you to see this. It's grizzly. It's necessary. It's reality. These darn critters, they re reproduce like crazy, and their goal in life is to, is to eat your food and contaminate it. And they don't just stop at one item. They want all your items to be wrecked and contaminated. So if you have 10 items, they want to get into all 10 of them. They're extremely evil, horrible little creatures. They're here to wreck your life. And they can't be reasoned with. They can't be... Uh, bribed they can't be bargained with they can't be scared away they're basically furry little demons a plague on humankind and these things uh they eat each other they're cannibals or mouseables they uh miceables they uh and this is probably what happened here there's very little to eat it's super cold one got caught and then the other one was like because they're too young to be mating i think so the other one was like hmm maybe i can eat this meat here it's stuck and he and it got stuck as well so um that's a trick you can do if you get one stuck leave it there for a while and then the, the mice will start getting uh, uh, mice hungry to eat themselves and another one will get stuck so I got two for the price of one trap I'm gonna leave a link uh, for these traps they're great this is I think it's a specific uh, it's called Tomcat brand or something I forget but these traps are amazing you just set them and forget them and put them where mice, you've seen mice run around. And eventually, if they slip up once and touch it, they're done. I mean, they can get loose. Uh, sometimes the smart ones will leverage themselves off a carpet or wires or something. They'll figure out how to, to undo themselves. But mostly, they they get stuck and then they give up. They just die. They, some of them want to live a long time. But... It doesn't matter once they're stuck to this I don't think I think there's a way to get them off if you're one of those fools that think you can help a demon and it'll reward you you can try it use a um, I think it's a mineral oil or something and try to get them off but these things I think they're here on earth to destroy humans and they carry all kinds of diseases and they crap everywhere they're crapping machines they crap they crap, 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 crap. If if that crap was like made out of gold or something, fine. But it's made out of crap. So uh, they eat all your food and they crap it out. And then they they make crap scent trails. They 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 communicate with their piss and their crap. Oh, they piss everywhere too. They'll piss on everything. So anything they touch is basically unclean, and you have to get rid of it. So. These are expensive, horrible creatures. I know there's a lot of people that believe in Mickey Mouse and everything's great. That's fake. It's it's stupid to believe that. This is the real Mickey Mouse. Um, they're here to destroy you and screw you up. So get snap out of it. I know it's it's sad, but this is this is reality, people. That these things are just wicked and. I'll leave a link to where I got these. It's uh, my Amazon affiliate. The way Amazon works is if you affiliate with them and you give people word of mouth because it's the most effective advertising and you get them to, to take a look or buy stuff, then Amazon gives you a little bit of money and reward for spreading the good word. And I'll tell you, this, these traps work and like that and don't believe me just try it if you got a problem and plus you can set these traps and if some other thing gets into them that it won't kill them 
like a snap trap. Like if you had like a, a pet pet, um, let's say you had a, you had a pet uh, a rabbit and it got stuck to this, you probably use that mineral, mineral oil and get them off of there. So, um, and I don't think kids want to eat this. So it's not like poison or it's not like snap trap. But, you know, so th these are probably among the safer traps. And if they do get stuck in your carpet or whatever, it's a mess. Um, you probably use a mineral oil trick though. So anyway, I just want to make this video and let's, let's get a little closer in view. Um, this is going to be grizzly for some people, but this is useful for artists. Like a lot of artists want to see, um, they want to have, you know how artists, they take people that pose for them. So these are really just posing for artists right now. And then if you look at uh, taxidermy, these are like posts for, like if you want to have a tax, practice taxidermy, you can take mice and I think you can pose them and stuff. So what am I going to do with these? I'm going to leave them out. There's a this crazy ass cat. It's completely like insane. It eats these. I leave it out for it and, and it's so grateful because it gets fresh meat. And then um, I get rid of these things. And that's that. So, yeah. So, um, here's the back. So, yeah. Now, occasionally they'll still be alive. You can handle it. Just keep away, keep your fingers away from their, their teeth because they'll try to grab your skin and eat it and pull your skin off. And you'll be bleeding everywhere. And then you'll have, a, like, infection from, like, the worst depths of, of bacteria from these horrible things because they got teeth they got teeth that keep growing and it makes them um, have to chew things it has to keep chewing 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 it probably chewed its foot off a little bit because it was freaking out I don't know what that red is but um, also when you get these don't wait too long depending on the temperature because they'll start uh, rotting and they'll melt through your floor um, they turn into to gooey, uh, caustic, nasty things. And then, uh, flies will find them and they'll, they'll put maggots up in them and the maggots will fly around or, uh, crawl and die. And it'll be like a complete crime scene. You don't want the, you can have, if you catch one, don't wait more than you have to, if you want to catch others. Cause it's, it's a fine, uh, uh, line between waiting too long and not so yeah so anyway that's nature it's, these are nasty demons I'm sorry it's I know you were probably raised to think it was Mickey Mouse but I'm sorry and life too life life is so hard and people don't want to help you and people just want to um, use you and get rid of you and so watch out because other people will, will make you go on their traps that are similar to this and you won't be able to leave. Even if you're not a demon, you can get trapped in these horrible traps. So just watch out. Life is really hard. Survive as long as you can. All right. So check out the link and you can start fighting these little stupid furry demons. Ah, nasty ass things. Okay. That's it for now. Military Industrial Museum, signing off.